I'm Victoria McLean and welcome to my Geek Gear Wizardry channel. <laughs> Geek Gear box. Um, I have no idea what this is inside this box. Um, I haven't seen any spoilers for this box, so thank you very much. I haven't looked in the box, it's still sealed on the bag. So if you'd like to see what's inside this box, then keep on watching. If you would like me to bring Hogwarts to you, then why not <laughs> subscribe to my channel? <laughs> oh my god, I forgot again. I've been doing this for a couple of years now, okay, and don't forget to press that all important notification bell as well. Let's get started. <gasps> so today I am using the beautiful Luna Love Goods wand. How gorgeous is that? The ch is it a tulip? Is it yeah, it's a tulip, isn't it? Is it a tulip? I think so. I'm not brilliant on my flowers. But how pretty is that? It's very short. I forget how short this wand actually is. But it's really, 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 really pretty, pretty. So I'm going to put it back before I break it. So as I said, I have not opened this box. It is still sealed. I am going to open it now. Oh, itchy nose, not good. If you want my love, boy, you gotta know you've got to work. Oh my god, I'm so, I love Little Mix, right? I've loved Little Mix for a few years now. And uh, Monica's just, well, I, I think I said it in the video before, Monica's just got tickets. So I'm like, yes. Um, so can't wait. It's not until May next year, but I cannot wait. I absolutely love Little Mix. So, wow, that box seems darker than usual. So we have the Geek Gear box. Again, I don't know anything about this box. I used to say, well, let's look at the, you know, these are the hints, blah, 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 blah. But I never got them. I never understood them. So, um, okay, for, straight away, I'm not fussed on the t-shirt. I could be wrong. It could turn out to be a really good t-shirt, but I'm not. It's the colour, I think. It's the colour. I don't like white t-shirts. Oh, actually, see, now this is why you need to take a step back and think, ooh, because I don't like white t-shirts, but I love the print. Look at that. That is so so cool! Broaden your mind. Cast yourselves into the future. I love Emma Thompson in that role. She's so good. How beautiful is that? That is obviously a prophecy orb from uh, Professor Trelawney. I have one up there, which is from Noble Collection. They're really cheap, actually. I think they're about thirty-four ninety-nine, something like that. They're not expensive to buy. No, tell a lie. They're the expensive ones. They're about fifty pound. The other one is the one from the prophecy room in a Ministry of Magic. That's about thirty four something, uh, but that's about fifty quid. That one, but that's really beautiful. I like the elephants there. That's very nice. My friend, my best mate, Jess, she's obsessed with elephants. If you want the magic of my social media to continue, please consider joining me. <laughs> joining, joining me on Patreon. I have some fantastic Patreons who have joined the incredible magical party for as little as £3 a month. The link is in my bio so join now and you also get to join us in an incredible Zoom party every month and you chat to me directly face to face and it would be lovely to meet you all. Come and see Patreon join today and I will speak to you very very soon. <laughs> the next item we have is a wand box. I haven't got my table in front of me. I've got my, my room is just full of stuff. You'll see why uh, in a few posts later on I think because um, as you know, I've teamed up with Very Nico. If you haven't seen the unboxing I did of theirs, then check out the link above. Um, but the apparently sales for the uh, the bags were very good, and so they sent me a message saying, "Pick whatever you want from the website." Never tell anybody that ever. Boy, did I go to town! Um, and they sent me all but one. 
um, because the item that I, the other item I chose, they only had one in stock. And so if I'd advertised it, it would have been really bad for them because they wouldn't have been able to fulfill orders. Um, but I ended up getting that last one anyway myself because I really wanted it. Because the good thing about Very Nico is you can pay by instalments. Um, but they've sent me some beautiful items that I cannot wait to share with you. So let's get back to this one. What is that? Oh my god, that's so weird. That is like so weird. I mean, good weird, but weird. Oh, oh my god, that's so cool. That is absolutely wicked. Look at that wand. Look at the detail on it, that's so cool. If you can hear somebody else talking, it's because my kids are above me and they are not being quiet. Look at that. That is absolutely awesome. I love that one, it's so different. One of my favorite ones is the um, is the Crimes of Grindelwald, not Crimes of Grindelwald, sorry. Um, Gallic Grindelwald's wand from Harry Potter, which is literally just a twisted stick. I have it here. It's incredibly, incredibly delicate, but it's one of my favourite ones because it's so different. It's not something that you would automatically assume was a wand. And so I quite like things like that, but they're very easily broken. So seeing things like this, that's pretty cool because that's not something you would normally think of as a wand. And it's, it's actually quite comfortable as well because it sits in your hand quite well. I like that one, that's really nice. Okay, so we have a box, oh. Oh, I really like it. I love their replicas. This is so nice. Um, we have a box, which is on the front is, as you can see, um, Marvolo Gaunt's ring. It's the, uh, the resurrection stone there, which turned out to be one of the Horcruxes. That is absolutely gorgeous. Let's hope that the actual item inside is just as good. Okay, you ready? Okay, so we have, do you know what? I actually thought that was gonna be plastic. I was gonna be so disappointed. That's actually really nice. It's huge. I really like that. That is actually pretty damn good. So here is the ring. Here is the one ring. Look at that wrong franchise, Victoria, but look at that. Isn't that beautiful? It is metal and that looks glut. There is no triangle shape inside it, but that is, it looks glass. It looks very, very well cut. It's not, it doesn't look cheaply made at all. That looks very, very nice indeed. Now I've got to be honest with you, Geek Gear have been producing some incredible, I'm wearing it, uh, incredible, incre incredible replicas of late. Um, and the replicas they're producing are spot on. Some of them might be smaller than the normal replicas, but the replicas have been spot on. And I do say, I mean, I pay for these subscription boxes, but I do say that they, for me personally, the last box I didn't think was good at all, the January one, um, but for me personally, the Geek Gear Standard boxes are incredible value for money. And if you use this discount code, Victoria10, you will get 10% off at Geek Gear. But I love their items. I wouldn't wear this, though okay because the color will come off on your fingers and probably go green so you don't want that but that is beautiful i absolutely love that item that is stunning that is absolutely gorgeous well done geek gear i'm gonna put it back in its box i love the box i love their packaging starting to get really good 
Uh, sometimes it's, you know, epic fail, but you can't please everybody and you can't get it right all the time. Do you know what I mean? But I've got to say that replicas are so good. Oh, so I found the wand card, Snaring Wand. It's, um, the core is Devil's Snare Root. That would explain a lot. So that's the wand card for the wand. How beautiful is that? It's 13 and three quarter inches. I don't know why I'm looking like above the lens. We have a poster, which is a Geek Gear exclusive, it says on it. Now I've not been a lover of posters. Um, there's only a handful of posters that I really like. And if I do like them, I will keep them. Otherwise I do sell them on my website. But um, the last couple that we've received have been obviously the Harry Potter posters. So let's have a look. What's this one? Gilderoy Lockhart, Most Charming Smile Award. No, which weekly's Most Charming Smile Award? Oh my God, that's so cool. No, that's not going anywhere because I absolutely love Gilderoy Lockhart so much. That is wicked. Look at that. Oh my God, I love Gilderoy Lockhart so much. He is so brilliant. I really would love it if Star Race did a Gilderoy Lockhart. Can you imagine the costume? It would be just outstanding. Uh, but they have said that they can't make one. I'm gutted. Okay, so we have a pin badge. I'll take it out of the packaging. I mean, I've got to be honest, this pin badge isn't screaming at me. It says Sunshine Daisies Butter Mellow. Turn the stupid fat rat, fat rat yellow. It is a pin badge of scabbers. It is a nice pin badge, but I'm not loving the whole flat. You know, it's kind of like, um, I don't know if it just seems like that everybody's doing these flat pin badges at the moment. And I love the 3D ones. I love the interactive ones that you can actually kind of move and do things with. They're so cool. But these ones, I know they're probably cheaper to rep, uh, to, reduce, uh, to produce as well, but they're just not, they don't wow me. Do you know what I mean? So, uh, yeah, it's a nice pin badge, but it's not something I'm like wow at. I'm not a fan of scabbers anyway, um, because obviously who is a fan of Wormtail, let's face it. So we have the last item before we uh, read the wizard's checklist is a box. I'm not sure what's in it. Okay, so it's a box covered in books. Um, so we're going to have a look. It's a door handle, is it? Oh wow, I love that. It's the restricted section door handle. Do you know what? That is going to go straight on my Harry Potter door. Look at that. How cool is that? That is beautiful. I love that. Not in the restricted section. I think we've been a bad influence on her. Look at that. That is so so good okay that is going on my harry potter door there we are it is now on my door <laughs> i love it my harry potter room is the restricted section okay so we have the wizards checklist just here and we have karis corner um as the youtuber spotlight so congratulations to you my darling uh we have truth serum Okay, so February 2021. Hello there, you magical creatures, and a massive thank you from all of us here at Geek Gear for purchasing the Geek Gear Wizardry books. It is our hope that these items have just um, we have designed and carefully packed into your box this month bring you some joy and magic to your door. Badly needed right now. Thank you for being part of our ever-growing family and we hope you love the items as much as we love you. Number one, broaden your minds. Uh, t-shirt, I love the print. I don't like the t-shirt being white because I won't wear it. I'll wear it to bed, um, but I don't wear white t-shirts. I really just find it drains my face. Two, license and exclusive Gilderoy Lockhart print. I did not know that was a licensed print. That is wicked, that makes me like it even more. Number three, restricted section door hanger. It is already on my Harry Potter door. Uh, number four, unique wand exclusive snaring wand. I really like that wand. Number five, legendary wizard ring replica. I love the ring so much. 
and six exclusive monthly prints. Sunshine Daisy's pr um, pin. Not so fussed on the pin. Um, again, I did say that. Not so fussed on the pin, but you can't please everybody. So thank you so, so, so much. I love the whole the quibbler, the quibbler look. So I really like that. I do like the new design. So what did you think of this box? Do you have this box? What is your favourite item? I think my favourite item it's got to be the ring i think the ring is really nice i really love the geek gear prop replicas they are so beautiful um, i'm trying to see one right now and i think i've put them away actually but uh i do love my prop replicas i loved the one in the, ne the necklace from the uh, it was at the valentine's day one loved that one so much but i haven't been fussed on the pins i know they're bringing pins in now rather than the charms but i'm not fussed on the pins that are out at the moment that are being in these boxes uh, but everyone's different aren't they the wizarding world community the harry potter community love pin badges so that's always going to be a winner but they're not pin badges i specifically love so until next time take care i love you all and i will speak to you very very soon more of my content take a look at this video right here or this video right here don't forget to like and subscribe